Hey y'all, so I'm back today with another product review. So I've been waiting for these products and I jumped on the sale. I believe it was through CVS or Walgreens. I will be having the links below, but they had a buy one, get one 50% off on their African Pride products. So first up, we have the Moisture Miracle Alloy and Coconut Water Detangle and Condition Pre-Shampoo. Now, I first saw this a year ago. Yeah, I know I'm late, but I was on the fence. I wasn't sure. But then I saw more and more people, but what, what, what did it in for me to say, okay, you need to go ahead and purchase it. I saw more people actually adding this to their regimen. And specifically Amber, uh, she is out in Belgium. And I really do like watching her videos because she has a lot of thick hair, okay? Different, different curl texture, but the thickness and density is what I appreciate. So she uses this product. I think that Jeanette Beauty also uses this product. Um, and it's basically, you guys, almost, it's a pre-poo is what it is. And so let's just go right into it. So on the jar here, the container, excuse me, it says helps minimize breakage for natural coils and curls. Now, let me back up and say this. I know a lot of you guys do not pre-shampoo. Um, I know a lot of people feel like it's an extra step. Absolutely it is. It is an extra step. But what I find when I pre-poo my hair, it helps with the cleansing um, step itself. It makes it easier, okay? Look, if I can do it with all of this, you can do it. I typically also do it um, the day before, depending on the current condition of my hair. So this product is made with no parabens, mineral oils, sulfates, or petroleum. That's really good, African pride. So let's go ahead and jump into the consistency. Now these products, like I said, are very affordable. And one of the reasons why I straight away, you guys, I'm, I'm within my regimen, I'm leaning towards better products or better ingredients, and those tend to be a little bit more pricier. So when I saw that these are under six, seven dollars, I'm thinking it's cheap, it's made with cheap ingredients. I'm not purchasing you, but it seems to work for a lot of people. Um, is it is extremely watery, extremely jiggly, which is okay because it's a pre shampoo. Um, smells good. It smells like, it smells peachy. Something in it smells very peachy. It's a translucent color, color by the way. The consistency is that of a aloe vera, aloe vera gel. That's basically what it is. Um, oh, I see why. I see why y'all like, like it. The slip, the slip is something to be messed with. Um, so you guys, I have a feeling this is going to do well on my hair for the simple fact I typically pre-poo. First of all, I pre-poo with whatever I have here, but with, if I'm out at the store and I see an aloe vera plant or whatever, I'll grab it. Um, uh, if I have an extra coconut milk in, in the cabinet here, I'll grab it. The best pre-shampoo that I use or pre-poo is Nappy Head Jehovah's Recipe. It's the mom. I do have a separate video on that. So now the directions state before cleansing, apply a generous amount to dry hair and distribute evenly. I'm not going to do that. I'm going to um, wet it just a little bit. It's, gonna, it's not going to be soaking wet, but dampen, dampen it a little bit and then add the product. Since it's watery, I won't need a lot of moisture. Okay, so use fingers or combs to detangle, rinse thoroughly for especially dry or tangled hair. Leave on for 15 to 30 minutes before re rinsing. We are gonna do that, we are gonna do that. We are gonna lightly apply water, we are gonna finger detangle. I have, <sighs> I'm going to be going in between using a pick and a wooden comb to detangle my hair. We're gonna leave it on for about 15, 20 minutes and then rinse it out and I'll come back on cam. All right, you guys, this is the next day and I'm just showing you what my hair looks like. It is extremely dry, very matted. Um, you can also see the different textures of my hair here. The front is more 4A, 4B. The back is all 4C, girl, especially with the shrinkage. You guys, my hair is bra length, but look at the, shrink the shrinkage. It's actually past bra length. Um, so what I'm going to do is lightly mist my hair to make it easier to section off. Um, and you guys, there is something going on with my hair, which I will be explaining here in a bit. So yeah, getting all this hair out the way because I need a smaller section to apply the pre-shampoo. 
Again, lightly misting with water. I'm going to do a little bit of finger detangling here, not a lot, because I will detangle, detangle mostly once the product is in. I have my Afro pick and a wooden comb here to help with the detangling. So, y'all, this product has great slip. Yes, I saw the reviews. I saw the hype. I was still optimistic. Um, yeah, I, I'm animated, girl. I am a Leo. Sorry, it's all over my face. So, yes, very, very, very nice. I was um, pleasantly surprised, excuse me. So, to my hair, my hair is extremely dry here. Um, my hair has felt drying no matter what I use. It feels like it feels like I've done two or three protein treatments on my hair. So I'm not sure if I am developing protein, excuse me, um, protein overload or if I have product buildup. It feels like every strand of my hair, and girl, I have a lot of hair, every strand of my hair is highly protected. It's, like, it's almost like every strand of my hair has a shield and I can't get through it. So, of course, I did an ACV rinse and then I deep conditioned my hair. I went in with a, um, I used the Oyons Honey Leave-In Conditioner, which is a very sticky <laughs> leave-in conditioner, but it felt great. That's a band-aid though. So what I'm going to be doing is stripping my hair. I'm going to be using a mud wash, uh, detoxing my hair, I should say, and then following up with a moisturizing deep conditioner. And y'all, I'm just going to have to up my deep conditioner routine and cleanse my hair often while simultaneously moisturizing my hair every two to three days to correct this because it just, it doesn't feel like my hair. Like when I touch my hair, I feel like there's something, again, like a barrier. I can't feel my hair. My hair doesn't feel like hair, if that makes sense. So yeah, enough of me ranting. Um, but that's basically to say this review and a VO5 hot oil treatment, that would be it for a couple of weeks until I can figure out a better regimen for my hair and I will be sharing uh, what I plan on doing as I stated to correct whatever is going on so let me hush up you guys I'm going to continue to section off my hair apply the water apply the pre shampoo and detangle Ryan Little <laughs> you guys I am done using again the pre shampoo as a detangler by African pride I will honestly have to say the hype is real this is one of the best pre shampoos store-bought 
you know, whatever you want to call it, pre-poo that I have used, ever used. And I would highly, highly recommend this for four type hair. You guys know that I use a lot of DIY concoctions and it's up there. Like if I don't feel like making my own pre-poo, I would definitely purchase this. Yeah, so. It went on really, really nice. Um, it detangled my hair fairly easy. My hair doesn't, there's no, you know, weird residue going on. It's a little sticky, but that's okay. And I'm gonna leave it on my hair. I just wanted to do this video as, as a detangling video, okay? Not as a treatment, just to make to make that clear. So yeah, you guys, I do highly recommend this product. So thank you so much for watching. Take care, bye.